Howdy. This is Beast Wars Razor Claw. Not to be confused with the mutant character who has the same name. The beast mode is a crab, and a fairly convincing one at that. But there are a few problems which you can see right away. The robot legs stick out glaringly from the back, and all the safety orange parts hurt the appearance. Whilst fairly proportionate, one claw is larger than the other due to the weapons they conceal. More on that in a while. Other than all that, he isn't too bad. I like the use of transparent blue plastic for the shell. Plus, the mold and paint detailing on it is very good. One feature that I think is quite clever is how the robot head forms the crab's jaw. It even moves a little since the head is on a ball joint. As for the rest of the articulation, the claws can move, like so. They can open and close, and each set of crab legs moves in unison. But I believe that's for transformation purposes only. Plus, crabs aren't exactly dynamic poses in real life, right? The transformation is fairly involved, but the legs are prone to popping off of the hips though they pop back on just as easily. The robot mode looks quite good mold wise, but again, the safety orange used for its colour scheme is quite loud. The only new paint apps revealed are those on the head. Ignoring the claws, he's great proportion-wise. Though he has some beast kibble on him, the crab legs fold nicely out of the way, while the shell halves add to the look of the mode. The Predacon Energon chip is on one of these halves. He's very poseable here. As you'd expect, the limbs provide most of the articulation. Unfortunately, all of his leg joints are floppy most likely after a good number of transforms. One claw opens up to reveal a gun. It doesn't fire anything, but looks decent. When you open up the large claw and push this back, spikes are deployed. Both of these work in beast mode too. There is a Seacon colored version of this mold, which comes with a video featuring two Beast Wars episodes. It was later released in Japan as the Maximal Rockbuster. It looks better than the original in my opinion. But if you can't find that one, this version is still decent. Next I'm doing a rant on teen bots. <sighs> I'm not looking forward to that.